Alrighty, so we have some fresh leaks coming out of the Six Flags in Busch Gardens Parks. Um, so starting with Six Flags, or sorry, SeaWorld and uh, uh, San Diego. I think I said Six Flags, but it's SeaWorld and Busch Gardens. So SeaWorld San Diego um, in 2019 looks like it's getting a Skywarp Horizon attraction. Um, that's really interesting. So um, it looks gorgeous. I love the theming. I love how SeaWorld does that blue over water work. Um, and then with the rock work as well, it always looks amazing. I love how they do that. So, um, it's a Skywarp Horizon flat ride roller coaster dynamic. It has airtime hills and banked curves and inversion. Um, so that's really exciting for them. I wasn't expecting that coming in 2019. So that's awesome. Um, it looks like SeaWorld San Antonio is getting a massive wooden coaster for 2020. Um, it's going to be 100 feet tall approximately, if not more, give or take. Um, it's to be discussed. 50 to 55 miles per hour, again, to be discussed. Located in a new Turtle Realm area of the park. And it, they're looking for the longest wooden coaster in Texas. So that's really exciting. Um, I, it looks like a GCI. Correct me down below if I'm wrong, but that to me that screams GCI based off of these poor quality renderings that have leaked. Um, but yeah, that's really exciting. It looks phenomenal. It looks like it has a really big out and back layout here. Um, yeah, that just looks amazing. Um, I, I can't tell too much, but definitely looks like something I would go check out for sure next year, or I should say in 2020, not next year. And then we have Busch Gardens Williamsburg. So this is where it gets really exciting. So opening May 2020, you have a 76 mile per hour multi-launch shuttle coaster. It's a family thrill coaster, apparently, and the fast, fastest coaster in Busch Gardens Williamsburg. With, and as seen in this rendering, it's the final drop and max speed seen from Italy Bridge. Now, um, to me, this has SNS written all over it. In fact, this has like Soaring with Dragon also written all over it, in my opinion. Um, definitely want to hear from you guys down below what you think, but it looks like an SNS coaster and Soaring with Dragons esque style coaster. And I think SNS is killing it. Um, Steel Curtain and um, oh man, I just had a total brain fart there. So Steel Curtain and Max Force look like amazing rides coming in 2019. And now there's getting rides out there for 2020 that also look amazing. Absolutely looking forward to what SNS has to offer. SeaWorld Orlando in 2020 looks like they're getting a coaster, a launch coaster, airtime and bank turns, inversions to be discussed, 55 miles per hour, and the location isn't yet announced. Now, this one's a little trickier. Um, more tricky. I don't know exactly what the manufacturer is. It's a little more difficult to tell in this rendering. I can't tell if it's S and S or premier rides. So I want your help down below. What do you guys think? Is this premier rides or S and S? It's very confusing to me. Um, but nonetheless, it looks like it has kind of a max force vibe to it. In my opinion, this almost looks very similar to max force. Um, if not, it's almost like max force and, um, West Coast racers mixed together, in my opinion, based off of this one really poor quality image. But this looks like a really exciting year for SeaWorld and Busch Gardens um, as a whole. And if it almost looks like every park, almost every park is getting a coaster in 2020 and the park and chain is doing really well. Um, so I'm really excited to see what they have up their sleeves. I really want to see I was really hoping for um, see uh, Busch Gardens Tampa. I wanted to see if their coaster leaked at all in, in these um, PowerPoint presentation, wherever it's from, but it looks like it didn't. I'll keep my eye out and I'll definitely release a video if that happens because I'm very curious about that as I'm sure all of you are. But yeah, definitely comment down below what you guys think of these additions coming to SeaWorld and Busch Gardens. I think I said Six Flags at the very beginning of the video. I'm so sorry. Um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Give the video a like, subscribe if you haven't, and share this video for others to watch. And as always, thanks for watching, guys, and have a good one. Bye.